we're not just made from our mistakes, but the way that we grow from it. What's, What's up, guys? I'm Devin Brock Johnson, participating in the 2020 Eleven Music Camp. Uh, the experience was super fun, actually. Like, I used to write myself, but I never got as comfortable with writing as when I was in that camp. But the whole collaborative process, even though it was online, it just felt like I needed these people for like all of my life, and I thought that was like the coolest part of it. It definitely helped me be comfortable with my writing style and just processes of writing. Sometimes it's hard, you know, but it's like, you know, throughout that camp, we just working through it that entire time. It felt so cool, it felt so natural and organic. Right? I mean, I feel like everyone should do it if they do plan on becoming a musician or just doing it because they have nothing else to do because, you know, we're in Corona, so it's like, what else could you be doing, dog? It's, it's very fun, though. It was something that I was very glad I could try out and something I was very happy I was inviting into. Hey, good evening. Are you guys ready for another great concert for the Love It On Your Lawn series? As part of our 2020 Eichelberger concert season, I sure hope you are. If you aren't already following us on Facebook or subscribing to our YouTube channel, take a minute and do that because we don't want you to miss any of it. We still have quite a bit of music that we hope will keep you dancing uh, as we move into the beautiful season of fall. We want to say a huge thank you to the Jack W. and Sally D. Eichelberger Foundation for their generous support as our season concert title sponsor. Thank you all so much for your support of helping us do what we're doing right now, and that's meeting people where they are, which happens to be at home. Uh, thank you to the Levitt Foundation for also your help in helping us to build community, especially during this time. Well, we've got the Wallens for you this evening, uh, a, a tremendous bluegrass duo. I hope you enjoy it. And that's thanks to the generosity of our concert sponsor, the Wilderness Agency. We want to say a big thank you to them. And without further ado, I'm going to kick it over to the Wilderness Agency. Take it away, guys. Enjoy tonight's concert. The power of Levitt Pavilion is that they're providing these free concerts that are bringing people together in this community in a way that only music can do. Wilderness Agency has been helping nonprofits tell their story since its inception, whether that's through capturing on video and pushing it out on social channels, through the creation of uh, websites and digital advertisements, annual reports, or further graphic design efforts. We're there to help support their mission. There's, there's too many musicians for me to name that inspire me. I, I listen to a little bit of everything. I take inspiration from all, all over the place. And I think that's one of the coolest things about Levitt Pavilion is they, they get a little bit of everybody. There's something for everybody all summer long. And it's a really great asset to the community in that aspect. The heart of what we do every day is to help strengthen and grow this community. Levitt Pavilion is one of those organizations that I am incredibly proud that our team partners with. Back the car, we're heading west. We'll find a place halfway to rest. The mountains are already calling me. Grab your suitcase and your hat, your coffee mug and trusty map. We're flying past the state lines and the trees. And we see dragons fighting bears up in the sky. Warriors and temples shining bright up high. There's a legend and a hair. Scenes are picked everywhere in constellations and the stars. Constellations and the stars. See the desert and the coast Two sips of beer after we toast This is the life I thought I'd never see Diners, goodwills, and some pubs We drive until the sun comes up the road reminds us we're already free And we see dragons fighting bears up in the sky Warriors and damsels shining bright up high There's a legend and a hair Seeds are picked everywhere in constellations and the stars 
constellations in the stars. We travel miles over pavement, cross plains into the ocean. The terrain is ever changing, but as long as the sky is clear, we see dragons fighting bears up in the sky. Warriors and damsels shining bright up high. There's a legend and a hate scenes are depicted everywhere in constellations in the stars. Constellations in the stars Thank you Well, it's so great to be here today. It's such an honor. We're the Wallens. We're from Indiana and this is our first time at the Levitt in Dayton and uh, live music <laughs> is so important Obviously, not just to us, but, but to everyone. And it feels like we need it more than ever right now. Yes, so, please. So we're grateful to be a, a small part of awesome things happening with the Levitt. Uh, the first song we played was one of Molly's originals. I have two different bluegrass songs about nature. That one, of course, is about stars, so it's called Constellations. And then we'll have one about trees later. Yes. But you'll have to wait for that one. Uh, I'm Brian. That's Molly, as I mentioned. And we're from a, a small town in Indiana of about 700 people. So uh, when we were out on the road uh, about a year ago, we decided to, to write a song about our little hometown. Well, we got stuck in two blizzards in one week. So we were kind of missing home a little bit because it was March. And normally March in Indiana is not snowy weather. That's true. So we ended up with this song out of it. This is called Back Home Again. They all say, let's drive through. They don't know they're missing you in this small town. Mm -hmm. They can drive right on past. We'll be here at long last, just me and you. Indiana's calling us. We wander far away from her. But always seem to find our way back home again. Mm. In the spring, we're feeling fine, looking for sunshine coming down right now. Mm. Summertime. Flies. Look at how that old moon shines over waves of green. Mm -hmm. Indiana's calling us. We wander far away from her, but always seem to find our way back home again. Mm -hmm. Indiana's calling us We wander far away from her But always seem to find our way Back home again mm. They all say, let's drive through They don't know they're missing you In this small town Well, thank you so much for listening. That was uh, one called Back Home Again. I want to do another song for you from a, a record that we've got coming out. It's called Our Neck of the Woods. It's a bluegrass album. It is. Uh, we love bluegrass music. Uh, I grew up playing it. Molly's from Kentucky originally. So I just come by it honestly. <laughs> as she likes to say. I'm, I'm not sure what, what she means as he if being a Hoosier is less of a claim more, to bluegrass. Way more bluegrass than I did when we met, so I can't say that anymore, I guess. But uh, <laughs> we've got a bunch of songs from our new album, and this next one is another Molly original. 
you were very well versed in introducing it last night. So you tell the background about how this came about. Well, I'm part of a Facebook songwriters group. And basically the way it works is there's a prompt and then you write a song around this phrase. And uh, the phrase was almost home. So I wrote a song and I played it for Molly and she decided to write one of her own. Because it kind of stuck with me. That phrase kind of sits with you for a little bit. And I wrote a song that has no autobiographical content, and so that was a first for me. Um, the only things that would come into play if we were to ever split up, which is not going to happen, would be that I would have to brew my own coffee, and I would light our entire dining set on fire, because I want to do that anyway. So, <laughs> this is called Finding Myself. Sand in the wood floor pain in the trend boxes are everywhere it starts to sit in this new life I'm building is far from you I'll clean this house my memory too I've changed the locks bought a new bed and frame brewed my own coffee started over again I find It's almost home without you. I started a fire with our dining chairs. The table is gone into thin air. You left me stranded in my own shame. I can only hope. You feel the same Change the locks Bought a new bed and frame Brewed my own coffee Started over again I find myself Breathing better each day And it's almost home Without you To something new Change the locks Bought a new bed and frame Brewed my own coffee Started over again I find myself Breathing better each day Change the locks Bought a new bed and frame Brewed my own coffee Started over again It's almost home. It's almost home. It's almost home without you. Thank you. So this is for all of the dog lovers out there in the <laughs> audience. We, Which should be everybody, you would hope, right? Well, there are cat people, too, and that's cool. But I'm this confused song, by them. This song <laughs> is about a dog. Uh, we have a dog named Charlie. And as I like to say, he's a used dog or a secondhand dog because we got him from our local animal shelter. Because we get everything shop. secondhand, you know? Yeah. I mean, so we love going to Goodwill. And uh, we get almost all of our, our stage clothes and stuff at uh, Goodwill and, and thrift shops. And uh, we drive an old truck, mm -hmm. you know. Our, our truck's 16 years old. So everything else is secondhand, so we figured the dog should be too. And he's awesome. His name is Charlie. 
And uh, he's a lab mix, and uh, he's almost two years old now. And he's got some wire hair or something in him. Yeah, he's a mutt, but uh, we <laughs> love him. And so this is his song. This is called Secondhand Charlie. Got a dog named Charlie. He's a real good one. Picked him up from the shelter just down the road. Got an old van and she's turning kind of silver. I older than dirt, but you turn the key and go. I don't need much to get by, just your love and a little red wine. All I need to feel at peace is a bad cup of coffee and brand new strengths. Have you seen my Stetson? I bought it at a thrift shop. I only gave six dollars. Huh. Can you believe that? Well, I never cared for that eastern seaboard Cause I like the cornfields And Charlie likes chasing cats Well, I don't need much to get by Just your love and a little red wine All I need to feel at it's a bad cup of coffee and brand new strings. Well, this life is a good one from the mouths to the hollers. As long as you're with me, I'll never sing blue. And her time was like water And God was a rain cloud Well, I still don't think I Could have enough with you Well, I don't need much to get by Just your love And a little red wine All I need to feel at peace this is a back of a coffee and brand new strings. Well, thank you so much for listening. Once again, we're the Wallens, and it's an honor to be part of this concert series at the Levitt Pavilion. Uh, we're just so excited to be part of, of something that does so much for live music and for the community. We're a little biased as musicians, but we, no. we just think live music <laughs> is, is really important. And uh, the fact that it's accessible to everybody uh, is, is really meaningful. And so, uh, again, we're just grateful to be a part of it. And uh, we play bluegrass and blues and hippie music. And uh, so we're going to do a, a song that Molly wrote about trees. Another bluegrass song about nature. That's but right. But this one's about trees, specifically aspen trees, because they're pretty neat. But we were out in Wyoming hiking last mm -hmm. year, and I came across this aspen that was growing straight up out of the ground, and it was completely dead, had gone completely black. But then there was this new one growing around it, around the same trunk, and just kind of went up this way and then grew up straight from there. And I just thought that was the coolest thing. So I decided to write a song from the perspective of that aspen tree. Standing Aspen, been around for many years. I've seen animals and people, and trouble spurned by fear. I watch over the forest from a place on top this hill. Changes happen round us, like changes always will. There's a storm moving eastward over mountains in my head. 
All I can do is stand up here and brace myself for death. The fires have invaded, I'm counting all my days. The forest will go on and on without me and my ways. I'll miss the jagged hillside, my roots will still dig in. I'll move up to the heavens and watch the changes when There's a storm moving eastward over mountains in my head. All I can do is stand up here and brace myself for death. So a new life has grown around me. I'll hold it till I go. This life is now my purpose. I feel my strength regain. Perhaps I'll just stay standing till death knocks once again. There's a storm moving eastward over mountains in my head. All I can do is stand up here and brace myself for death. Here I stand in Aspen. Been around for many years I still watch over the forest My friend death is always near Thank you So I've been fortunate enough to make a living from music For uh, almost 10 years now And I've gotten to travel a lot of different places Singing and playing And I uh, met Molly almost four years ago Beginning of 2017. Yes. And uh, she jumped on board shortly thereafter. That and, November. <laughs> uh, so now we get to, to do this together. We're married and uh, we travel all over the place playing music. And we're just so thankful for that, uh, that we wrote a song about it. So uh, this is really just about gratitude. It's called A Song to Give. Stars coming out the wind in your face Early morning the birds will sing Coffee cups and reaching for your ring It's not about the money that we don't have Cause the years are something you don't get back and if all we had was a song to give, that's all we needed. Thrift shops or a record store. something you don't get back and if all we had was a song to give that's all we
a stomp board and my guitar, a beat up suitcase and a mason jar. about the money that we don't have oh cause the years are something you don't get back god if all we had was a song to give if all we had was a song to give that's all we You got to talk about it. Well, for, for those that are out there in the <laughs> audience who don't know what my wife is referring mm -hmm. to when she says it, uh, there's it a could be anything. There's a there's an instrument on stage, uh, and it's called a stomp board. The last song mentions it, and uh, I just want to show everybody watching in case they're curious. If you, if you hear the kick drum coming through the speakers, it's pretty strange. What's responsible for that sound? And it's homemade. And it's made actually by Brian's dad, which we're kind of proud of. So here it is. This is called a stomp board, and it's our kick drum. And uh, the first one was made from a cabinet door and a salad bowl. Uh, but this is an upgraded version. Uh, my dad's pretty creative. So this is stomp board 3.0, uh, which is actually made out of maple. There's a microphone under the bowl, which is a salad bowl made from copper. So it's gotten very fancy. But uh, we take this everywhere with us because it's a lot smaller than a kick drum and easier to deal with. It's also a lot smaller than the original one. It really is a cabinet door and a salad bowl. We have it up in our attic, and we brought it out when we were doing Facebook Lives all the time because people were like, wait, we can actually see it. Yeah. And so I went and got all the ones that we had upstairs. <laughs> all right, so let's do another one of your songs, oh, Molly. Yeah. So this song came about because we went to visit the National Civil Rights Museum down in Memphis, and it's at the Lorraine Motel where MLK Jr. was shot and so you walk through and you actually walk past that hotel room and it stays with you for a little bit if you're human. Um, and so I just got thinking about that and about what I can do about it. And I don't have an answer, but I wrote this song that was kind of questioning all of it called We've Got a Ways to Go. see the pain in their eyes when you can't keep them safe when you know injustice lives no we've got a ways to go when harm comes your way when there's nothing left to say when you feel helpless rage to go we've got a ways to go we've got a ways to go till the prevails and hate is gone we've got a ways to go when oppression rears its head when innocence is denied When death is all around No, we've got a ways to go We've got a ways to go We've got a ways to go Till love prevails and hate is gone We've got a ways to go We've got a ways to 
go We've got a ways to go Till the prevails and hate is gone We've got a ways to go Till the prevails and hate is gone We've got a ways to go So Brian wrote kind of the answer to that song. Yeah, this is a, a song uh, about some of the things we believe in. Uh, we call ourselves hippies because For a reason. <laughs> uh, we're, we're into, you know, the whole idea of peace and love and, and kindness. And Molly never wears shoes. Yeah. So that that's too. part of my Kentucky roots, though, I guess. <laughs> so what to do about everything going on in the world? Well, of course, the answer is, is just to love people. Mm -hmm. So uh, I wrote this song and. Molly uh, said we should just call it another hippie song because we got, have lots. We've got so many <laughs> of them. So here it is. It's all about love. It's all there is. The rest don't matter, it comes down to this You give love to your fellow man And you try to do the best that you can It's all about love, it's all about love. and it's always been It will remain, it will remain. until the end Just like a song of the no wind It's, it's all, all about love, it's all there is We'll work and sweat, struggle and grind Well, if it's just for money, it won't get you by Oh, if you want to live, not afraid to die You're going to need kindness, give it a try But it's all about love, it's, all about love. And it's always been It will remain, it will remain. until the end Just like a song, floating on the wind It's all about love it's all there is Well, I've been to the Rockies Way up high I've been to California Through the desert drive Out on the Great Lakes by the riverside There's only one way To live it right It's all about love, it's all about love. But it's always been It will remain, it will remain Until the end Just like a song Of the on the wind It's all about love It's all there is It's all about love It's all there is You guys so we're going to get out the other weird guitar this one is a carbon fiber uh, but i've got an even stranger one over here but the carbon fiber one comes in handy because when we play outside it doesn't go out of tune nearly as often and i've dropped it more than once and it's still you know intact so it's very handy in that way but this one i touch with very like soft hands because i don't want to drop it i want to make sure that it's okay because we love it so much this is a three-string cigar box guitar. It's made by a friend of ours, Tony Hardwick. Um, he calls himself AWH Music. And it's a type of guitar that originated in the hill country of Mississippi. So a lot of blues music has been played on guitars like this. It's three strings instead of six like a, a normal guitar would have. So we have a lot of fun with it. So we'll do a couple blues songs on the three-string cigar box. This is a little traveling blues song we wrote, one called Don't Cry For Me. Well, honey, don't cry for me. Uh 
Honey, don't cry for me Cause of trouble that you can't see Don't cry for me Well, when I'm on the road and gone Well, when I'm on the road and gone Then I'll sing a goodbye song When I'm gone Well, if you're ever sad and blue Well, if you're ever sad and blue well, I'll come running straight to you If you're sad and blue oh, Well, honey, don't cry for me oh, Well, honey, don't cry for me Cause of trouble that you can't see don't cry for me So let's say goodbye for now Oh, let's say goodbye for now but I'll be back someday, somehow But it's goodbye for now Well, honey, don't cry for me Well, honey, don't cry for me Cause of trouble that you can't see Don't cry for me Don't cry for me Well, thank you all for listening to us. We are the Wallens, and uh, we're here from Indiana. It's such a pleasure to be at the Levitt Pavilion, and uh, we encourage everybody watching to contribute to what they're doing because it's really important. And if you want to find out more about us, we're at the Wallens Music online, and uh, we're on Spotify and Apple Music and all that good stuff. So we're going to leave you with a blues song on the cigar box guitar, and this is an instrumental, so... Uh, this is from a style called Delta Blues, and I, I can see Molly laughing already. <laughs> so Brian likes to name his songs very bluntly. Mm -hmm. Like he has a song about Colorado that he called Colorado. And this is my favorite version of that joke because it's called the Arkansas Blues. It's a blues song. Mm -hmm. He wrote in Arkansas. It's an instrumental, so he could have named it anything else. <laughs> and he chose to name it the most obvious thing. But hey, it's Delta Blues written in the delta of arkansas i think it makes sense oh lord anyway guys <laughs> here it is a little blues instrumental
Thank you so much. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I, I certainly did. And I want to say again, a big thank you to the Wilderness Agency for your generous support in helping us do this amazing mission in our community. Thank you to the Jack W. and Sally D. Eichelberger Foundation and the Levitt Foundation also for your ongoing support of making this all possible. Hey, don't forget, if you have someone in your family, that uh, youngster, a, a teenager or student in your family that might be interested in joining us for a songwriting workshop, we have more information available on our website at levittdayton.org uh, backslash songwriting. The camp starts in October, so we don't want you to miss any of it. It's going to be a really great experience working with um, musicians from all over the country. So check it out. Um, and we look forward to seeing you next week as we have Dave Greer's classic jazz stompers. See you next Thursday. And don't forget, we start at 7, 7.15 on YouTube. See ya. Have a great week. We're not just made from our mistakes, but the way that we grow from it. What's up, guys? I'm Devin Brock Johnson, participating in the 2011 Music Camp. Uh, the experience was super fun, actually. Like, I used to write myself, but I never got as comfortable with writing as when I was in that camp. But the whole collaborative process, even though it was online, it just felt like I knew these people for like, all of my life, and I thought that was like, the coolest part of it. It definitely helped me be comfortable with my writing style and just processes of writing. Sometimes it's hard, you know, but it's like, you know, throughout that camp, we just working through it that entire time. It felt so cool, it felt so natural and organic. Like, I mean, I feel like everyone should do it if they do plan on becoming a musician or just doing it because they have nothing else to do because, you know, we're in Corona, so it's like, what else could you be doing, dog? It's, it's very fun, though. It's something that I was very glad I could try out and something I was very happy I was invited into. I wanna go home, I wanna go home.